Doug, we are still seeing a big mess out here after that deadly crash this morning. You still see the tire tracks, also a lot of plastic and debris left on the sidewalk. The loudest crash I've ever heard in my life. A tragic and terrifying start to a Wednesday morning. I slept through earthquakes. This woke me up from a dead sleep. Albuquerque police say just after six, two people, a man and a woman, stole this work van while it was warming up. Officers are in the area and located that vehicle and noticed that it was driving reckless. APD tried to stop them, but the suspects sped off. We're told officers backed away. We don't, we don't chase stolen vehicles. I mean, we don't, we don't want to endanger the public. But then moments later, you see it on surveillance. That crash. I just woke up with a big bang. I had to sit down and sit up and just say, was that in my dream or was that for real? Witnesses saying the van ran the stop sign and smashed right into this red sedan. Police say those two suspects ran north here on this street. Cops not far behind. Paramedics got there and found three people inside the small car. The lady, the driver was in pain, including a female driver. She was just head holding her head. Also, it is a kid. Oh, man, a car seat and your heart and just drops. It's just like, man, I hope he's OK. Police confirming tonight one person is dead. Oh, I hate to hear that, but not yet releasing that victim's name or age. Shelly and Doug, just minutes ago, we saw someone come over to this scene and leave those flowers, that bouquet right there at the scene. Now, Albuquerque police say they do think they know who the suspects are. They say they're still investigating, watching surveillance video from the area, trying to figure out where that man and woman went. I'm told when they're caught, those people will face auto theft and vehicle homicide charges. Reporting live tonight, Northeast Albuquerque, I'm Angela Brower, KYT Action 7 News.